Hello everyone. Welcome to Fresh Culinary at Summerland Gardens. <laughs> <laughs> That's how we're doing. Fresh Culinary Summerland Gardens. Hey, so tonight y'all we're gonna do um Cajun! Yay! Yes, yes. So and we're gonna start out with crab dip. And all this stuff is pretty simple to make, and, and the Trinity is uh, the trick to everything. All right. So now what I'm going to do first. That's uh -huh. good. Excuse me. <laughs> What's happening? You like your We're dip? Your dip. <laughs> I know, really. Like this is Food Network or something. <laughs> <laughs> it might be. Someday. Mm -hmm. I have faith. Yeah. So, okay. We're going to start with the crab dip, and this is so simple. I just want y'all to see, really, Cajun food, it seems like people make it sound like it's a lot harder to cook than it really is. And you think about it. When you're in Louisiana, I mean, what do you do for a living? You're doing something on the water, something in the yard, like you're farming, you're crawfishing, or you're ranching. You know, you got soft shell crab, you got shrimp, uh, alligator, you got your cows, your chickens, everything. Well, you don't have time to be making these meals that last all day long to make. you got to make something fast. So a lot of this stuff is pretty quick to make. I mean, you can make an etouffee in like an hour. So, it probably less now. So I'm going to put the butter in here for the crab dip. And I'm going to add all of my, uh, my trinity here. It's going to be my half, it's, I got one cup of onions. I got a half a cup of green bell peppers. I have a half a cup of celery. Oh yeah, let's do a half a teaspoon. I won't do a whole one of cayenne. And we'll do some of this beautiful salt that Julie got for us. It's this pink sea salt. She went by the rabbis and got it for me. Not really. She went to that. What did you get? Sammy's organic. Sammy's organic. So we'll put some of that in there. It's a really pretty pink salt. Do y'all want to look at it? I'll pass it around for you. You can try it. It's not real salty. You can use my cayenne spoon. <laughs> Yeah, so I melt my butter is what I do, and what I'm going to do is just cook this until they wilt. So I'm melting my butter. <laughs> I'm just playing, y'all. <laughs> and so I'll put everything in here at once. And you know how whenever it gets kind of translucent, that's how I want it. This so much makes me think of Aunt Lily and my grandma, whenever you, they do this, they put it in the skillet, you can just, the whole house just smells up. Mm -hmm. So delicious. And, and those are those straight up Cajun Catholics. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. They all got that blue hair. <laughs> so I'm serious. And they all have, it's all, and listen, it's so funny because they, uh, they get their hair done on Fridays. And so they go home, <laughs> every Friday they get their little hairs done and it's all pretty and everything. So they go home and they put on a little shower cap to sleep in for a week. <laughs> and by the time they get back there the next Friday, they got so much hairspray in their hair. It's so cute. <laughs> but that's how that generation was. They're all like in their 90s now. My Aunt Lily tells me the other day she thinks she's getting old because she couldn't carry back two gallons of pecans from the pasture. She goes, like, she goes I'm getting old, Pam. I go, what, why do you think that ain't Lily? She's, she's going to be 91. <laughs> I went and picked my pecans today and I could only carry two gallons. <laughs> oh, that's an indication you're getting old, huh? Two gallons. Yeah, when you, can come, when you can't do it, you're old. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to put my crab meat in, y'all. And I, I tell you, I always get the... Up here, you can't really get fresh seafood. Y'all know that. Mm -hmm. But um, I really like the jumbo lump crab. So here we got the crab meat in here. And it's, uh, I'm just going to let that cook and settle on in there and break up a little bit. And once it gets hot, then I'm going to add my cream cheese. And I am not here to cook fat-free or cook healthy. I am just here to She's a pastry chef. So, so we got the crab meat going. Not far yet. Now I'm putting in my cream cheese. <laughs> like a bad like scientist. A <laughs> <laughs> no, Anything that has two giant chunks of cream cheese in it. You know it's going to be good. good. <laughs> That's like emerald. It's like it's like that that ding know, dang that. heavy cream and butter and make a billion bazillion dollars with that. Right here we go. We got a crab dip, y'all. Hey, but you know what? I want y'all to taste the pot. Everybody grab a cracker. 